Hi, Nick here. These videos explain a concept of time as an interactive process of energy exchange with an emergent future. Some people say that time is just a human concept connected to movement. They say when there is no movement, there is no time. But if our eyes were more sensitive to the light of the electromagnetic spectrum, we would be able to see that there is always movement in the form of light photon vibrations or oscillations with everything radiating light in a similar way to an electric light ball. This continuous process of absorption and emission of light photon energy forms the ever-changing world of our everyday life, forming the passage of time with the outward momentum of light forming an arrow of time relative to each object or life form. We are the creators in an emergent process unfolding photon by photon relative to the energy and momentum of our actions. Each object or individual life form is in the center of their own reference frame in the moment of now as an interactive part of this process. It is this personalization of being in the moment of now in the center of your own reference frame that gives us the concept of mind with each one of us having our own unique personal view of the universe. With the electrical activity that forms conscious awareness being the most advanced part of a universal process, each one of us is at the forefront of the creative process with our own created timeline from the past to an uncertain future that at the smallest scale of this process is represented by the probability function or quantum wave particle function of quantum mechanics. Within such a process, the wave particle duality of light and matter in the form of electrons is forming a blank canvas that we can interact with, forming the possible into the actual. The universe is a continuum based on one universal process of energy exchange with an uncertain future unfolding relative to the atoms of the periodic table and the individual wavelengths of the electromagnetic spectrum of light. The light photon forms a movement of positive and negative charge and whenever objects touch it is charge that makes contact. Also, we have the build-up and organization of charge relative to the membrane of each living cell within us. But wait, there's more. The only reason why this can be explained as a universal process is because at high temperature we have a phase change in matter forming plasma with charge beam to cover a whole star or even a large area of interstellar space. Therefore we can have one universal process from the cells within us to the stars above us. Bye for now. Please sub and share. It will help the promotion of this fairy.